5 30 in the morning sitting doing breath exercise my wife is doing worship behind me there is a worship room on the table the mobile phone is on playing some religious song in another room my son is still tossing and turning sleeping covering himself by blanket pretending that he still want to sleep while doing exercise a lot of things are lingering in my mind that basically comes or a stem from the past experience that we have these all things is happening at around 5:30 once i finish my exercise my wife is still worshiping but when i head to my chair i open diary i start reviewing all the vocabulary that i have mentioned already so that is my general routine if i have once i turn on all pages i review it it means now somewhere i'm trying that to adjust in my mind and after a while i turn on my laptop i watch something at the time my wife after finishing worship went to the kitchen mumbling that there is no flour no rice what should i cook i was aware of this because last day she already told us told me or we ordered online but i know that online order when i see the tracking status it will come today by evening or might take longer so that doesn't make sense to wait now i instead of coming to work directly promised her that do another things until i'll bring the rice and i went to the kitchen i grabbed the garbage bag and then came back i already had a tad the earbud in my ears mobile phone in my packet and the podcast was on i was listening one of the great podcaster a person who always delivers a compelling idea a story or many other things now i throw that garbage on the garbage pile and then i took u turn and reach the shop assuming that shop might not have opened it but no it turned out to be wrong i went there it was open i asked him without delay please give me a rice i explained him that i need now otherwise he was just putting all the stuff outside generally he had a huge shop so in the early morning first time when he comes he just take all the stuff and keep arranging that is his job i know if i'll not impact emphasize if i know a stress if i don't stress it may time it, he may take longer so i stressed again i re it read please i want it now because she needs to cook it for my son or he needs to go to a school now he understood he smiled he nodded head he went inside the shop and he was just pouring what uh, putting rice in a bag and until then one more customer came and he asked something but i was first so he was taking me on priority finally he waited uh, he waited or he gave it to me i paid him by online nowadays we know we do that and i called my wife while leaving from the shop hey i bought the rice i'm reaching in 5 minutes and meanwhile she told me please bring curd also oh my god i left already the shop but there was another shop where i could have bought it so i said okay i was walking after a few steps there is another shop i bought curd and then i left the shop again i'm listening the podcast i'm not a squandering time or i reached to home i ascended the staircase crossed the threshold reached to the kitchen put these all <laughs> it was only two items i put these all items in the kitchen she smiled then i came back because my walking time is started now or was started then 
so i again descended staircase listening podcast something lingering in my mind when i was walking only i saw two person walking one person he was walking his dog and then i crossed that area the person he just crossed me along with the dog that was wagging its tail you know the nature of a dog now i took right and i came here where i'm now speaking but for this i did a little practice about the mouth practice for the sound and now i'm recording this so guys just assume instead of this all story i would have said hey learn this five way you will become a great speaker follow this step you will get a good chance to be a great communicator that got more attractive that is seductive people want to listen that but what i did because i am a teacher i am aware i am well aware what works when it comes to communication skill or what does not work i know very well that only practice works only speaking works when it comes to communication because a speaking demands a lot of speaking practice and that is what every time whenever i come i try to say i'm always trying to convince people don't get scared it's not rocket science and what to speak that is one of the great challenge that every time pop up in the people mind what to speak i'm very terrified when i stand in front of mirror in front of mobile or when i want to record video why are you terrified who is asking you to record some history that happened in the past who is wanting you to explain some scientific term here nobody so why you are in confusion why don't you vomit whatever is lingering in your mind whatever happened with you now whatever what is what all things are happening so these a small problem is a hindrance when it comes to a spoken part yeah why not because majority of people they have already considered it a hard nut to crack it is i know it is one of the horrifying or terrified a skill that everybody needs to embrace yeah so it is okay you must embrace it you must accept it i agree but it does not mean that we cannot speak suppose if majority of people i know a handful of people not majority of people a handful of people they are good as speaker they are speaking they are narrating or they are laughing enjoying they are not let the stress allowing to be hurdle in their communication so if these guy they are enjoying communication why they are doing that because they have gone through a lot of rigorous practice it is not that they started or immediately they were super lucky that they got this skill no this a skill demands practice it does not matter how much money you have how great you are whatever your personality is it does not respect these all things it respect only the practice a guy who is struggling for his everyday survival he may achieve it a guy who had a lavish lifestyle who can achieve it but the matter is both have to practice both need to go with the practice and that is why the skill it is always said i remember the past time the guardian they used to say that everything can be stolen people might steal everything people might divide everything but your knowledge will not be divided why because it's your it will remain with you permanent or any skill set that you develop any time you may harness it around the life and that turn to be right that was explicit yeah it worked so when it comes to communication skill it is one of the greatest skill compared to all the skill because here 
you are able to narrate you are able to influence people you are able to express idea whatever is happening and people will understand it that is why communication skill is always given priority yeah so these are the only aspects that makes us great speaker yeah or i understand when it comes to non native we have to go with lot of practice we need to learn grammar vocabulary structure again and again i come across these all aspects of this skill set but again if something that we know it's a great rewardful it will gives us a respect why shouldn't we go with that we are spending many year to become engineer to become doctor to become psychologist whatever profession we go with but all those things work i know but once you have communication skill you have ingrained it you have learned it a well way of communication the methodology that works for a persuasive communication skill once you have that it means it will add a great value so suppose you are a great doctor or you are a great engineer you are working somewhere but you don't know how to speak well and the guy who has half of knowledge that you have when it comes to your stream engineering he is good or well communicated you know his career growth will be double than you why because he knows what will elevate what will cultivate the career growth and that is why always and always it has been given priority so one uh, i think it's been a month i was reading an article it was super informative for me so in that article it was mentioned that 97% engineer they are deprived of well communication skill and that is why they are not going to get the plum job the job they dream even though they are well qualified a skill wise when it comes to their working style but why what all the problem that is causing them to not grab what they want the well communication skill yes because the company nowadays the company you know they are well organized globally not in a certain area so the company wants somebody who may who may resolve the problem globally and resolving problem globally means you will come across the challenge of communication skill and that is why the english is dominating all around the world when it comes to communication skill why because people know that only there should be some medium that may work around the globe so when you are sitting somewhere in the great company that company have had a lot of business around the globe and he wants you to resolve the problem sitting in your country in another country there what medium you use so bridging the gap only english communication skill works guy nowadays one great thing i can say but that has lot of disadvantage and that is ai tool that is high advanced technology so these all technology you just put any event it will elaborate that in the writing it will work a lot yeah while writing email or some event you are trying to portray something drafting email you will get a lot of help by internet and somewhere because of that support we are lacking the strength we are lacking our curiosity thirst to enhance our capacity about language so one side it's great it's helping a lot but the other side what if you want to explain by speaking you cannot see or recite it in front of team in front of client customer whoever you were there so for that you must learn it whatever technology the, it will get advanced the modern age whatever things will come in the future it will not enhance your communication skill you need to work on it or only you need to work it there is no alternate solution there won't be in the future i'm sure but again the value will never be degraded 
the value will remain intact when it comes to English communication skills. Yeah, you heard it right. So without delaying, again and again, what I'm making you understand, if you want to learn great English or if you want to learn English, how to communicate, you must narrate your story. Whatever things is coming across you or all day long. You might see my all video. You will notice that most of the time I'm narrating about my situation. Every day you find some different and even in your journey, everyday routine, lifestyle, you will come across a lot of situations that occur differently than last day. But we need to understand that we must be focused. We must spot. Many times we just think like half-minded. We are not ingraining that. We are not understanding in detail. So every day we come across some different situation. We must understand and try to catch that narrative. And then we will get to know what vocabulary we are missing to narrate that. What a structure you wanted to make that super effective. And then you need to learn that. So this is what when I teach, I properly care. Because these all are the working professionals. They are senior people. So whenever I make them understand, when I make them uh, when I ask them to recite, to speak, in between, I keep adding, I keep twisting, I keep tweaking some great vocabulary, some great structure that is well fit for the situation. And they understand later on that, yeah, it was greater than what I said. And that works fine. So these are the aspects, these are the steps that we may take or we can enhance yeah we can elevate we can enrich yeah so thank you bye bye sun has come is somewhere telling me the time it's white day today again thank god yesterday it was sunny day so all the cloth that i washed it was not dried for last two days but yesterday finally i hang it on the rooftop on the rope and i waited sometime it seemed that it's gonna drizzle but it did not or ultimately sun was hard and all got dried and today I'm sure there is no cloth that is wet and again if I take bath so I'm free means there is no problem and one problem also occurred when it is drizzling or raining it causes gridlock it causes huge traffic on the road so there are some disadvantages but there are, there are advantages also of the rainy season or the drizzling or downpour so great guys i'm sure you might get some clue you might get some hint how we can improve and you may notice about me i uh, have been teaching globally and these all are the spec that i followed and i am persuading people to follow these all things and one day you will realize that these all aspects are only the key point that will enrich your way of communication and it will make you a great communicator Thank you. Bye-bye.